this is Enigma. I'm going to be doing your bonus reads for February 2024. This is a general message, so take what resonates and leave what does not resonate. For more personals, I'm always available for you guys. You can reach out on WhatsApp, Instagram, or email. First of readings, white spells, and premium charge crystals. Feel free to reach out to me on the following details given down below in the description box. Some on rising or Venus sign and Taurus, special course watchers can watch this reading. All right. Write down as a claim, I am a blessing from the universe. Now let's begin with a positive mind. Let's see. Taurus, please. All right. So we have the Queen of Cups. Okay. We have the Queen of Cups. We have the King of Swords. We have the King of Cups. Oh, currently your focus is on the wrong person, and what is not uh, being seen, what you can't see, is this person coming towards you after some time, after some patience. Like have some patience. This is what it is saying. If someone doesn't want to give you what you expect, don't ask for it. Don't keep begging for it. Okay, that's the message that I'm getting. That. Is a very clear message that you are dealing with someone that is either has blocked you or about to block you. There is um, a fine line, okay? So self-respect is the key here. You might be falling in love with the wrong person. So you have to be careful that you live in the reality. Don't be in this energy where someone is already giving you a red signal and you are still taking it as a green sign. So there is someone that is like a red flag in your life, but you don't want to see it, okay? You're living in your dream. So somewhere, Taurus, you have to back off from someone that is being cold and unavailable. That is one sign. Another thing that I'm seeing over here is that your soulmate definitely is coming into your life after some time, but you have to, like you have to uh, seed, like you have to put the seed okay so once you you know lay a seed that someone you're going to be with or someone that is meant to be in your life is coming into my life i'm seeing have some patience it, it will take time for this person to appear in your life because there are two people okay have some patience don't expect this cold-hearted person to change for you expect the right person to come i'm seeing the color red over here which means that you're very close to meeting your soulmate i feel you even though we are apart you know that your soulmate is around the corner but you have to understand that the one that you're focusing on right now is not the one for you the one that you want the one that you would be happy with the one that you're sensing in your surroundings is coming into your life real soon Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, Energy. Okay. Justice. Okay. You desire someone that treats you equally. And it's time that you're going to meet the person that is going to treat you equally. And if someone is creating an imbalance between you and them in this connection, then that person is not the one for you. Some of you that is a Libra. But... What I am saying over here is you have to open up your mind, not just follow your heart. It's fine to be open heart, you know, emotionally, but at the same time, you have to be very clear in making decisions. Stay focused. Once you've made a decision, stick to it. Don't keep changing your, you know, uh, decision. Don't keep changing your mind. That is something very, very important here. Okay. So make a decision that if someone is making things difficult for you, you need to walk away from that person. Walking away is slightly tough for you. You have kept yourself, you know, um, stuck on someone. Some of you, this could not be for each and every one. But because what I'm sensing is, uh, Taurus, some of you have come out of that energy. Some of you are still stuck on someone that is just not meant for you. And you know this thing, but you don't want to see it. Okay. Some of you just come out of this energy. But what I'm seeing is your biggest dream whatever you wanted like your soulmate you wanted your soulmate to connect with you wanted someone to connect with your heart that person is coming towards your dream is about to be fulfilled you don't realize it but it's about to be fulfilled probably there is an aquarius coming in someone that 
balances you. This is what I'm seeing. And then I'm seeing Four of Pentacles, The Fool, The Hermit. Wow. It's time for you, Taurus, to focus all the energies towards you. It is time for you to focus on your money. It's time for you to focus on your well-being. It's time for you to live life of your dreams. It's time for you to go solo and enjoy the freedom that God has given you. Because in this free time, in this solo time, you will get a lot of ideas. You will make something out of your life. You will get, uh, you know, you will be doing better. You will be able to focus on your money, on your career, on your profession better. You will be able to heal yourself. There are a lot of things that you can do, self-care you can do in this period when you're single. So this time where you're single, make the best out of it. It won't come again, okay? Universe is saying to embrace this energy of singleness and in this energy, you will learn something new. You will grow your income. You will go for a higher study or something like you will do, which will bring money, okay? So this is what I'm seeing. Some of you, it's time for you to get into that hermit mode. Virgo, Aquarius is coming towards you. Peace is the key here. Peace. Self-love. Right now, what you are working on is loving yourself, embracing yourself, doing things that make you happy. I'm seeing accessorizing yourself, making yourself feel good. Traveling is also another key element that is going to um, be a part of your Feb month traveling to places that you like to but yes someone is coming towards you with a lot of love with the king and queen of cups and the ace of cups is a clear energy that you're about to meet your soulmate while you're on your way towards your goals traveling doing random things then you're having the seven of cups yeah you have a lot of options coming after you to be honest Taurus you will meet a lot of people on your way towards your destination you will meet a lot of people you will party you will hang out you will do a lot of things like celebrate life you will have a lot of options coming to it and this person is one of those options that you meet it's time for you to have fun they go out and have fun this is what i'm seeing wow i feel like when you go out in an event or a party or something that's where you're going to meet this person that is where this connection will develop between you and this person so very clearly i'm sensing that you're about to meet this person in a group of people where you're just partying celebrating and enjoying so that's how you guys are going to come together and there is a hundred and one percent assurity that you're about to meet your soulmate because you know why i got the queen of cups i got the king of cups and then i got the ace of cups is the beginning and from there onwards you guys are two of cups getting together like soulmates so you're about to meet your soulmate and it's happening real soon okay so it's a beautiful moment for you and your soulmate you guys could be from different religion but it's in a gathering in a social gathering that's how you meet another sign social gathering that's how you meet this person but the four of wands is an outcome that that's another sign that you guys are going to get married four of wands so marriage is something that I can assure you. It might be a little later, but a relationship that turns into a forever commitment is something that I'm seeing. Four of Wands, you guys are going to make marry together. You guys are going to celebrate, announce your marriage, you know, uh, live in the same house, do all things together. This is the energy that I'm seeing. This person is an office person. Like they have a good reputation. They have at, they're at a high rank. Uh, because you can see the way they're standing like there is honor there's respect there's authority so these are the things someone's birthday comes on 22 that's another sign oh my god oh my god do you see this look at this similarity this is also four this is four this is four 
this is two of cups two plus two four i'm seeing as a very strong energy that universe is consistently telling you to have patience because you're going to be with your soulmate you will be dating your soulmate that person that you will get married to and that person is an office person they could be in a field of military as well anything basically but this person is highly disciplined with their work but you're going to meet this person the number four is also the sign that you're going to have a beautiful stable relationship with the person of your dreams Taurus claim this in the comment section say I have my soulmate I'm living my best life and I'm the happiest person on earth thank you universe that's what you have to say another thing that I'm seeing is free yourself relax everything is gonna be fine just stop keeping yourself stuck in expecting things good things from the wrong person if you're expecting good things from the wrong person you will be heavily disappointed and i cannot do anything about it so there is a time where you have to free yourself if something is not meant to be let it go trust the person that you're going to be with is someone that you will be able to trust they will be able to trust you the real base the foundation the seed of this connection is going to be loyalty the trust as i was telling you they could be from different religion but that does not matter until unless your souls are connected you guys will date the date word is coming very strongly like it's popping out which means that you guys are going to date and this is going to be the best date ever you have never experienced such a beautiful moment of your life like you're thankful you're being so thankful to the universe that it's happening for you another sign please the seven chakra yes i feel like universe is giving you a hint that something big is about to happen in your career front i'm seeing there's a lot of growth coming in your career and you are going to experience infinite abundance if you keep growing your knowledge like however you should be growing your knowledge please keep growing your knowledge because a lot of abundance is coming into your life if you're going to be unstoppable at work all right so what i'm seeing next is um currently universe is giving you consistent signals that it's time for you to work on your passion to work on your dreams your ambition work on it okay um and you will excel it's something create you're going to put creative skills in your work whatever your work is whatever your profession is you'll be highly creative in it okay so you're going to put your ideas into work that is going to make you very successful and currently you're very sensitive to um bringing new ideas creating things believe in the impossible you're like i can't do this no it's not possible so you know what you need to do believe in the impossible something impossible something different this time is something that you're about to do take a breather relax have fun have faith in your dreams yes some of you have been dreaming about doing something in your life but you're too scared of taking a risk you're like no i can't do it it's not possible you're just making things up in your mind so universe is saying that currently the spirit is very lucky for you and work on your goals what could be your major blockage i see the messages your blockage could be what is that imagination you're not putting your imagination into action you're just simply imagining things in the mind you you want to do this you want to do that but you're not taking action so stop being that you need to nourish it you need to Uh, I'm also seeing the more you gain knowledge about your work, the better you can visualize. This is also another thing that I'm seeing. See anything else? Do you have anything regarding your love?
they chose you so don't go after someone that you have chosen go after someone that is choosing you so your soulmate that's a big sign is going to choose you over anybody else and you will be clear about it it's not like you're still living in confusion you're not sure you don't know you're trying to get readings it's not like that let me see any advice for you wanted to come out control issues stop trying to control things for yourself let go of something that does not meant to be allow that is meant to be and just live your life peace at peace most probable signs other than the ones that i told you could be okay this one to come out aries We have Cancer, we have Pisces, we have Aries other than the ones that I told you. Libra, Aquarius also there. Okay, so from Aries to Pisces, what does your person think and feel for you? Aries is in love with you, crazy madly deeply. Taurus. The tallest person is going to come towards you while you're traveling, when you're meeting new people, socializing, because there's a long distance between the two of you. And it's going to be an unexpected meeting. The Gemini. The Gemini is uh, aggressive, and I don't think this connection can work out for a pretty long time. Cancer is definitely cheating on you. They're already married or they're in a relationship. Try to find out more. Leo. Leo is mad about you. Oh, uh, I feel like the Leo person finds really difficult to detach themselves and there's someone that will get attached to you and will keep thinking about you a lot. But there is something fishy about it that you need to know first before you give your heart away. Virgo is not the person. I think this is someone that is living in their trauma. Um, Libra. Libra really feels a strong connection towards you and I feel they are about to reach out to you. They were planning to reach out to you. They think this is the right time. Scorpio. Scorpio is very stressed out about their finances. So their focus is somewhere else. Sagittarius. Okay. So Sagittarius person is obsessed with work and I feel this person is a hard worker. And they really want you to appreciate them and support them in this. They want to help uh, work this connection out as well. Capricorn, very passionate about you. They're coming towards you in a rushing move, with a rushing move. Aquarius. The Aquarius person is... Um, I feel like they think that you're a challenge and they like challenges and that is why this person is taking a lot of interest in you. They're coming towards you with passion and excitement. Then we have Pisces. They need to give up on the past person so that they can start a new journey with you. Okay, it will take some time because if they are in this stuck situation right now. Let me do the charms. seeing is a person is new love okay this is someone completely new and someone could be from France or free could be the name Hungary half free something like that someone's from Hungary someone's from Denmark someone's a doctor mm -hmm. someone is an HR home this person feels like home some of you are going to buy a new house or you guys are going to live together and they will they will be asking for this or they will visit your home but this person feels like home to you. Henry, Jeffrey, Donald could be the name. Frederick could be the name. Someone's from Holland. Freddy. Okay. Harmin, Harleen, Aurora, or anything like that. Ras, something like R A S. Racial is also there. 
someone is a professor, a doctor, administration services, you could be working there. Um, someone from Australia, Canada. Um, Honduras. Oh. Someone's name is Fatima. Father. Farhan. Sean. Das. Da. That could be the surname. Can you think of any other country? Write down the comment section. Soha could be the name. Danny. Darlin. Fiji, someone from Fiji, someone from South Africa, San Francisco, America, India, Russia. Oman, Serbia, Syria. Finland, Pakistan, the color red, that means marriage. I'm seeing this person is like, yeah, somewhere that is like uh, distance between you guys, are, they're far away. Someone is like a pure pundit watching this. Uh, there is a need for you to do a regular prayer you know if there is any kind of a curse you will be released okay so that's your message i hope you've enjoyed this wonderful read and one more thing is left your person is going to treat you like you're a king or a queen of their life very sophisticated personality i'm seeing white and black color will be uh, important over here this also means they will be clear hearted they will not keep you in any kind of confusion okay it's a lot of love and a stable foundation so you will build a stable foundation not only in love but in your career as well so that's about it i hope you enjoyed this wonderful great taurus please do like share comment and subscribe to i and i'll see you back again for more uh take care bye